Alex Jabaley, founder and director and CEO of CEO Gaming, the channel that you're tuning into. Um, first off, I want to say thank you. For the last 10 years, you guys have supported CEO, uh, and our YouTube is in, has been home to a lot of footage from all our past events, our tournaments, our matches, our finals, and also recap and teaser trailers and all that. So the 30,000 of you that have been subscribed uh, since day one, thank you so much for over the years. Uh, I want to just give you an update you know, 2020 has been a crazy year for all of us. And as you can see over my passion and dedication to the fighting game community and gaming as a whole, I've amassed a huge collection of stuff, uh, whether it's from companies supporting CEO or setting me free cool stuff or me purchasing as a support to the great artists that created and designed a lot of the stuff that you see here. But 2020 has been really rough, you know, with me having to postpone CEO from June to December, my prime event and then canceling it outright, which I've mentally gotten used to the fact that I'm not hosting anything this year since March, CEO Dreamland, which is the last event. And it really pained me as I've been doing this for 10 years and it started out as a hobby. I just want to compete, hang out with all you guys, run tournaments and just see the smiles of everyone coming together from all over the world for our events. And as you know, if you've been following me along through my personal social media at Jabali on Twitter, that you know I've been very fortunate thanks to your support and you guys to work in the industry, to host live wrestling events from New Japan Pro Wrestling in 2018 to the now amazing All Elite Wrestling uh, last year and hope to do that again with them in the future when events do return. But it's been, you know, a year where I've been able to finally reset mentally, enjoy myself and have fun being a gamer, being a fan at home while waiting for the world to get back to normal. And hopefully we're on that path right now, but I'm not here to talk about all that stuff. I'm here to tell you guys what I plan to do as CEO. Now, I've always wanted to be an influencer, and it actually kind of happened by accident running events over the years and then realizing the effect that my staff and my events had on people, and also that people would look to me for advice in the gaming industry, whether it was getting a job behind the scenes in esports or what consoles to buy, what systems to buy. And now I want to be able to talk more about what I love and enjoy in my own personal time. So for now, while there are no events happening anytime soon, and I have been streaming regularly on twitch.tv slash CEO Gaming, I want to open up CEO Gaming to be everything that I've enjoyed and that I've enjoyed because of you guys. So whether it's from videos of me and my wonderful dog Tifa that I ended up getting earlier this year, a Jack Russell Beagle mix that has changed my life for the better. It's been able to ground me, let me relax, have dedication to you know something almost every single day uh, at home, and make me feel like I have a real home now because I was always on the road between CEO, fortunate enough to run dream hack events all across the world that I was never really home to appreciate it. And the one plus that I got out of COVID, it was the real connections I've been able to make with people again and the excitement of when things do get back to normal and that we can, you know, come together again. But until then, I don't know when that's going to be. Hopefully next summer, next fall, we don't know. But CEO is not going anywhere financially. Thanks to you guys that kept Dreamland alive uh, and a new CEO merch and dice store that's going to be going up actually by Black Friday this year of November 2020 and have a lot of cool designs and that's going to help support CEO. If you want to subscribe to the Twitch channel and sub, you can do that as well. If you enjoy that content, please support it. I'd love your feedback. And for now, I'm going to make CEO and try to grow that. And if it grows into something special, uh, then I can do more with that and I can bring on people to video edit and help me. I've actually spent a lot of time actually learning for the first time Photoshop video editing. I've been using DaVinci 16, 17 is about to come out and kind of just having fun with it and learning and, and wanting to add more uh, to things that I can do that, that way I can help put out more content for you guys. And so until events return and we can get back to putting all our tournament match and stuff, I'm going to have... Uh, unboxing videos, reviews, stuff that I enjoy, stuff that you guys might want to see me talk about, give you a tour of you know the rest of my house that I've amassed over the years and talk about more historic things like the CEO championship belts, uh, my connections in the industry and all the great things I've been able to do thanks to the great people I've worked with. So I just want to give you an update. Everything's fine. I'm physically doing great. It's actually the best shape I've been able to get into uh, since I probably started running tournaments and traveling when it got serious back in 2014-15 uh, when CEO really started to take off and I got more jobs in the industry and, and freelance gigs. So uh, with that, 
this coming week, I'm going to have a couple unboxing videos talking about the history. And I want to make my videos a little bit different than the usual unboxings, take forever to open that up, you know, talk about it, talk about what it means to me how to get the stuff obviously and hopefully i can work with companies to promote more and, and be a bigger influencer uh and just stay on top of things because for now i don't think we're going anywhere please stay safe and i just want to share my love and passion of gaming and everything that i've done over the years again thanks to you guys so much for that support since day one and i hope you'll support ceo gaming please tell your friends to you know it's free to subscribe to the youtube channel I'm not a good shill, honestly. I've always promoted and, be and promoted stuff that I be genuinely believed in. I would never promote a product that and lie about it or say this is an awesome product, you need to get it. But everyone has, you know, uh, different likes and tastes and uh, so I'm always going to be trying to be fair and if you like what you see, go grab it yourself, stuff like that. So with that said, I just want to say one more time, thank you guys. I hope you're staying safe this year. I hope you've been able to game and have fun. Uh, I'm excited for the next gen of consoles. PlayStation 5 is coming out this week. Xbox Series X. Yeah, that's the one. Um, it will also be out and uh, excited for that. And hopefully when the fighting game community gets back together, you know, we'll see what's next. Maybe Street Fighter 6, Tekken 8, uh, next Soul Calibur, Super Smash Brothers still going strong. I know they just released Steve from Minecraft, which is exciting. So until then, please tune in. Uh, please let me know what you think, uh, what you would like to see. Uh, I could talk about, you know, workout stuff as well. I've been thinking about getting into that. I actually have a sister in Dubai who's a personal trainer who year round daily, uh, you know, promotes and motivates everyone around her. And it's great to see, you know, I'm nearing 38 years old now. I actually am 38 years old and it's harder as you get older, but you can still feel the best you're going to feel that day, uh, by staying healthy. So hopefully help share those tips with you as well. But you know, to TLDR at all too long. Don't read. Yeah, that's it. I want to just say that CO is going to be fine. I am signed for a couple more years. Uh, you know, next couple years are in Daytona. I'm looking to bring things back to Disney World, hopefully in the year 2025. We'll see how things go with COVID and if that changes my plans. CO Taku, hope to bring that back next September, which is still my proudest event to this day. Thanks to the anime community for believing in that product and that event experience. And, you know, I can't wait to do that again for now. You're going to see Jabali doing what he loves and sharing what he's uh, come to love all these years. And I, I really hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you learn from it. And again, I'm always around. You want to tweet at me, ask me questions, please don't hesitate. Uh, leave a comment below. You know, I've always been here for you guys. I've always been transparent. I'm happy. I've always been happy. CEO, DreamHack, that never felt like a job. Yes, I would travel and be gone for like four or five days at a time planning events, hiring and stressing over making sure the event ran perfectly. But at the end of the day, I would come home and be proud of the work that I got to accomplish with other people behind the scenes. And so I can't wait to do that again. Until then, please continue to watch, enjoy, and again, stay safe this fall because things are going to get crazy.